Man, look at this mess right here. I wasn't even supposed to do a 22 week video this week. Just because I was feeling so annoyed and negative as hell. Um, but I kind of figure. Hold on, let me move his ass. Uh oh. I kind of figure since I um made the epidural video, that I may as well go ahead and make a um 22 week video and knock it out while I um got a little bit of time on my hands. And show you my fish I bought. I got a beta. And believe it or not, fish are supposed to be relaxing. And I needed that. I think I paid maybe like ten dollars for the whole thing. Um plus him and his food. So yeah. Um, that's been helping me with relaxing. Uh, it does work. Um, anyway, um, I'm not gonna. I had a ton of baby buys uh, these past two weeks, and in all reality, I really don't feel like opening up that closet and going through all this stuff tonight. So, um, what I am going to show you, well, tell you, I did get his um, bed and bath supplies. Um, all done. Uh, most of his zero to three month clothes are done. Um, what else did I get before the end? Speed and supplies are done, so yeah, that's a good thing. So I don't have to worry about none of those anymore. So basically, my only thing right now is oh, and I did get diapers. I started buying diapers, like I told you guys last video. Um, I did start buying diapers, so yeah, basically, I am stacked up on a lot of stuff that I would need. Um, now, I'm going to go through the baby bags right quick first. I did uh, go ahead and finish off my feeding items by getting a um, quick serve bottle warmer. Um, from by the first years, I don't know how it works. I've never tried this one before, but the other one that I had for my son was a lot cheaper than this, so I'm assuming that it's maybe at least a little bit decent. Um, what else? Where is my... I went to my week appointment and got my week this week. Uh, I'm with EZF Baby. I have been on that fruit kick. I really ain't been on, um, on my vegetables too hard. But I could do either or, to be honest with you. But I've just been craving a lot of sweets. That's why I've been getting fruit because I've really been craving a lot of sweets like Gushers and candy apples and rainbow laughing no what those things the rainbow um airheads so anyway the sweet and sour kind so basically that's why i've been getting a lot of fruit because i've been craving a lot of sugar um so anyway got that i actually found this at the um health clinic when i got there um it's a program for moms to be and i have my registration form here um it's supposed to be um I lost a sheet of it, but I got what I need, basically. It's for breastfeeding, prenatal care, nutrition, dental care, parenting, and newborn care. So, I need to be, I need to freshen up on all of those. So, yeah. Um, especially breastfeeding. I'm considering going longer than I did with my son this time. So, yeah. That's a maybe, though. Um, so, yeah. I'm going to go ahead and do this. They, they supposedly give you, um... A lot of free stuff during the program, and it lasts from August 8th to November 14th. And my due date is like two weeks after November. It's this program lasts November 14th. My due date is November 30th, so it's like right after that the program ends. So yeah, I'm really trying to get in it, and I gotta show up there every Wednesday. So ready to give me something nice to do to get out the house, since I am, like I said, on an online student. I do not get out much. Um, let me see. And I want to show you guys one of his outfits that came in the mail. The other one didn't get here yet. And I'm going to call them tomorrow because, like, I really want that outfit. Um, it's by happybirthdayboutique.com. Like I told you guys, they got a lot, a lot of cute stuff on there. Um, it's a little bit more expensive than my usual Walmart stuff. But it's uh, it's cute. And by the looks of it, the material is, like, well worth it because it looked like some good material that's made out of stuff. So, Anyway, I finally found him for a winter time. The perfect bring home outfit. It is this sleeper gown. Like I said, I love those. And it says king on the front. Um, it's got a little imprint on the sleeves. So yeah, that's a sleeper gown for him. 
and it has the hat to match like I don't know what you call these hats they like you know little yeah but it's like that but yeah it matches the gown perfectly so that's it now that is his bring home outfit and I really want to get him like some red socks and um because these don't have the fold over things in the middle so probably like some red socks and some red um mitts to go with it um so that's gonna be his spring comb outfit already um i got another cute one it's like a little golf outfit but they didn't send it in the pack i don't know why they didn't but they did um and this is a complete health care kit that i got with his um i just want to show this one too because i really like this for 13 dollars. it comes with the digital thermometer pack of probes bottle medicine dispenser medicine syringe nasal aspirators aspirator gum stimulator toothbrush alcohol wax emergency contact card and travel case only thing that this didn't come with that i may need to go get separate um is actually some nail clippers um and then for my final one for this week um like i said I, i'm not gonna go through showing you guys everything because most of it's just pretty plain um Basically, I got them about 13 outfits total now. He has a hat for every outfit. I didn't do that on purpose, but then I realized the other day, I was like, wow, he has a hat for every outfit. And he has a hat that goes with every outfit perfectly. Um, so more socks, more mitts. So, yeah. Um, and his bath stuff, bath supply, his bathtub, his washcloths, his little duckies to go in it. His diapers, his wipes, a bunch of bunch of bunch of wipes. Um, so yeah, that basically. Um, what else did I get? I'm sure I got more stuff than that, but I just can't think of it. But it's cool anyway. But guess what arrived in the mail? Um, I got my Moses basket that I wanted for him to sleep in. Um, gosh, I didn't take it out the. Um, let me see if I can show you guys a better view of it. Ugh. Okay, this is basically how it looks. It's just like look, basically what it says is a little um, it's a little Moses basket or whatever. The inside has a um, has a little mattress in it, and I did order um, two sets of um, so four sheets um to go in inside and you change the sheets and everything. Um, this is. What's supposed to go around the inside for a little cat and on the inside like that right there to go around. Um, so I don't know. I don't, and Oh gosh, you know what I need to get though? Now that I just thought about it. Because I have left on my list to get. I need a car seat, um, um, a stroller, a bouncer, and a swing. Um, but while I'm at it, if you, if you, if you can look up nap nannies. I think it's what called nap nanny. I was, I put that below also. If you can look up nap nannies, they're like little recliners that the baby can sit up in halfway. Because I, I think those are a good idea. And I may, if the nap nannies are small enough, I may just take it and put it inside of here. Um, it's um, or not. I could just take it and sit them up on it and on bed. But anyway, they're like little recliners because most babies. I didn't. I never. I remember. I never like laying my son down flat because. He would constantly like choke on it. He would slop so much and spit up so much that he would constantly choke on it, and it kept me worrying a lot. But when I set him up a little bit, he would do it as much. So I was thinking about getting one of those. And if I do go on, if I do, when I do go online and get it, I will be sure to let you guys know um, how I think, how 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 I, how I like it um, beforehand. But this um, basket right here, I can tell you off real. I really like this. It's it's it's, it's really lightweight. Um, I can tell it's going to be um, a comfortable spot for my baby to sleep. Um, if you, I'm going to get a stand for it, but I plan on cold sleeping a lot too. So this to me would be good for cold sleeping. That way I can put him beside me in the bed and he can still sleep with me, but I won't stand as, uh, a chance of really rolling over on him or anything like that. Then he'll be in this little basket. And the material of it is good it's really lightweight um i honestly paid 30 dollars for it but i get it from amazon i paid 30 dollars for it 
And honestly, I like it so much. I really do. I'm not a crib person. I do. I don't like cribs. Um, to be honest, I slept my son in his playpen. Um, now I did move to a crib when he was like, how was he when I made him move to a crib? It was like three, maybe four months when I moved to a crib. And honestly, he never slept in it because he didn't like it and I didn't like it. I can't tell you why. I just, I don't know. But I really, 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 really like this Moses basket. And I really want, I remember I wanted one my son so bad, but I never ended up getting one. But now, yeah. So, yeah. Only thing is it comes with the handles or whatever to it. So, if your boyfriend is the, um, or your husband um, is thinking about spending time with the baby while you're at work or whatever and watching them, like mine is most likely or because we got different schedules. Um, yeah, you need to tell him not to pick it up by the handles with the baby in it because it is like, you know, you, you just don't need to do that basically. Um, and I did get him some little blankets to go inside of it. So, yeah. My son, let me go. I'm in 11 minutes. I'm going to hurt my symptoms. My symptoms for this week have been basically a lot of kicking, a lot of round ligament pain. Every time I sneeze, it hurts like hell. Um, what else? Um, annoying. Um, basically, input or opinion for, you know, just annoying, like, Oh, you're carrying a girl because I'm carrying a uh, kind of, um, I guess, what most would consider high. I carry it like that with my son, too. He set up like a basketball in my stomach. Um, but yeah, and like, that's a girl, man. It's a boy, it's a girl, it's a boy. And it's kind of annoying when I know I'm having a boy, but you keep telling me that my boy looks like a girl in a way. So yeah, that's annoying as shit. Um, let me see what else. <sighs> Very emotional, very sensitive, but that's needless to say. Um, cravings have been, like I said, a lot, a lot of sweets. And basically just sweets and meat. Like, sweets and meat. Um, so, yeah. I'm excited to be here 22 weeks. Can't believe I'm here already. Um, went from taking my, I remember I went from taking my pregnancy test and being like, oh, you know, trying to figure out was I pregnant or not to so realizing there's a little thing, little poppy seed up in there. And now he is officially, you come and sneak, come here, babe. I woke him up talking so much. Now he is officially, um, eight and a half inches from head to rump. And that is maybe about like this, this big or something like that. That is pretty, and I know it is because I had my rule out earlier. That is really big. So, yeah, and I can feel them kicking in there. The kicks aren't hard as hell yet to the point where they hurt. Come on, boo. This is my nephew. But, yeah, the kicks aren't hard as hell to the point where, come on. I can't lift them. <laughs> to the point where they hurt yet. Uh, but they are like, um, yeah, they're there for sure. And he's been spending all week with me. He's my Oompa Loompa. Oh. He'll probably be up in a bit because he always wake up around, yeah, this time of morning for a little while to just get him something to eat and watch the old gabba gabba. That's all he wants to watch. That show is driving me effing nuts now. But yeah, um, so I'm going to do a quick belly shot if I can. Mm -hmm. Okay, uh, yeah, I'm going to do a very, hold on, boo. I'm gonna do a quick, quick, quick belly shot right now. And, uh, oh, shout out to my homegirl, Feezy Up Baby. And I'm waiting on the 31st, too, and I think you're having a girl. Um, but yeah, I just wanted to throw that out there. And I like your belly bean because I just got one this week, too. But anyway, um, this is my quick before 15 minute belly shot. So that's from the side. And this is from the front. And this one on the other side. And this is what it up. Okay, am I at oh, Okay, 34 seconds. And this is what it up. And from the side. Okay. And this is what it's up in. This one looks straight. And this one on the other side. And it's up in. What is what I look like? Right there. Okay. So, anyway. um, I gotta go because it's 14 minutes and 53 seconds. And I don't feel like recording this shit over. So, thanks for watching.